My name is Jorgen Odegaard. I'm coming from Syracuse, Utah, small little town. I entered in a collaboration competition with uh, Bro Safari, and uh, Supplies flew me out here to open up Bro Safari's boat stage here at Mystery Land. This is my first time on the East Coast, first time at Mystery Land. It looks large, very large. I mean, I've lived in a small town like my entire life, so it's crazy coming out here to the big city. So the concept behind the contest was, you know, start a really bare bones idea, uh, upload the file to Splice, and then just make it public and just let people have at it. So I worked on the collaboration, uploading every version. Every time you save in Ableton, it, it saves to Splice. You save the, the project file, and then you can enter your comments of what you changed. So it's the most convenient way to collaborate. Sound design was on point, the mix was on point. He kept elements of the original idea. You know, he added leads, he added like a little vocal sample, made an intro, an outro, it was completely written out. The second he told me I, I won, he was like instantly like, yo, I want to work on this right away. Yeah. Like, are you in this? I like, can you add me to the project? And then he just worked on it, sent me an update in like a half hour. And I was like, damn, okay, well, let's get working. It's so simple to use Splice for something like this because so it's all instantaneous. I think it's really important that we're constantly looking for you know like the next producers to like come out and, to, and join the spotlight. And now everything's instantaneous with the internet, and you know people can reach out and talk to their favorite you know musician, singer, producer, whatever. Seven days ago, I was just chilling in my basement, just thinking that things were gonna keep going the same way they were, you know what I mean? Just keep putting music out on my own, but it's amazing. You can just download the software, make music with it, you know what I mean? Enter in competitions like this, and then fly out to New York. And you know, to be able to like, you know, hear his story from, you know, being plucked up out of Utah and just yeah. flown to New York to play at Mystery Land, you know, it's amazing to me, and I'm really stoked that I was able to be a part of it. Thank you.